Hurricane. Kamasi? Celebrities continue to send their well wishes for a speedy recovery for actor Luke Perry after his reported stroke. Perry is 52 years old and it's bringing up the conversation about stroke risk in younger adults. The reality is strokes can happen to anyone at any age, although the risk goes up dramatically starting after 55. A stroke is caused by a blood clot or a blood vessel rupturing, preventing blood flow to the brain. There's been a recent increase in women of childbearing age suffering strokes, women like Claudia Fortunato. She was only 34 when she suffered a stroke after she had a headache for a couple of days. Now, two years later, she's still in intensive therapy, including for her speech. It was probably two days after the, uh, the stroke uh, that I really, uh, you know, I, I woke up and I really heard it. Um, and, he, and I was like, what? <laughs> because, you know, I, I did not think that there was, at my age, I would be having a stroke. Mm. Claudia still doesn't know what caused her stroke. She took birth control for many years, which can increase stroke risk in some women. But she says she can't have a baby now because it would put her at a much higher risk of a second stroke. University of Kentucky neurologist Larry Goldstein told us women in general are more likely to have a stroke. And stroke kills more women than men. Stroke is very often preventable. Know your individual risk factors. Know the ways you know, that you can reduce your risk through lifestyle interventions. Know what your particular risk factors are, high blood pressure, atrial fibrillation. Some things that you can do to risk to control or reduce your stroke risk include not smoking, getting regular exercise, and eating healthy. Also, not drinking alcohol to excess. Diabetes, high cholesterol, and heart disease are also increased risk factors.